I declare you innocent and that you are fully exonerated. A free man now with a cleared name. And right now, I'm just, I'm feeling so free. Emotions were high Wednesday during Greg Kelly's exoneration hearing in Williamson County as he was given his life back. I look forward to a lot of awesome things in my life, but ultimately I just look forward to being free. Kelly was officially declared innocent and fully exonerated in the very courtroom where he was originally sentenced to 25 years in prison for aggravated sexual assault of a child more than half a decade ago. I've been dreaming of this day. It felt like the past six years have been a nightmare for me. Um, but to be declared fully innocent and me to go on with my life, um, it's an absolute blessing. While behind bars, the former Leander High School football player maintained his innocence and never gave up hope. Prison was a, was a place full of, full of terrifying experiences for me, but it was also a place where I found God. Three years into his sentence, he was released on bond following new evidence in the case, evidence which would ultimately overturn his original guilty verdict. From here on out, um, I found a new sense of freedom. Uh, I think uh, it's fair to say that I, I can appreciate freedom more than anybody right now. As this case comes to a close, the work for Kelly is far from over. He plans to hold Cedar Park police accountable for how they initially handled his case. People like that having a badge is completely terrifying. And ultimately, I would be scared to death to live in Cedar Park knowing that a detective can literally point you out, label you out, and solely seek out an investigation no matter if there's another assailant or not. From the friends and family who never gave up on him, Kelly says he has a lot to be thankful for on the day before Thanksgiving. And as for the future, He's looking forward to his wedding in January.